deadly earthquakes in Puerto Rico early this morning, and now help is coming for the island territory. News 2's Riley Benson tells us what's being done here in the Low Country. From the earthquake in Puerto Rico this morning were felt here in the Low Country and could continue to impact the Charleston area in the days to come. A 6.4 magnitude earthquake shook the island of Puerto Rico early this morning, leaving at least one dead, knocking out power to most of the island and sending Puerto Rico into a state of emergency. An aftershock hit the island roughly three hours after the initial quake. These two come a day after a 5.8 magnitude earthquake rumbled across Puerto Rico on Monday. Ben Williamson, who is the director of communications for the American Red Cross's Palmetto Division, says the organization is preparing to send help and resources as needed. We are actually right now in the process of calling out to volunteers across our state for anyone that can speak Spanish that is available, um, disaster volunteers, that if they need to, they'll be on standby to deploy. And while Williamson says Red Cross is checking with its volunteers as far as availability goes, he says it could be a couple days before the organization truly knows what resources are needed. In downtown Charleston, Riley Benson, Calon 2.